Filmmaker Charlie Min is releasing his latest documentary-style movie. It looks at a recent and dramatic drop in murders in Juarez. The murder rate is down 90% from two years ago, but it still hovers at around 40 murders a month, and all of it just a few hundred yards from the UTEP campus. Min has some good news. I'm happy to report that uh, more people are going back to Juarez as a result. But the murder rate is still large, even for a city approaching two million people. Charlie calls it a war, and the images seem to confirm that. This is a very emotional war. It's depicted on film that way. I hope a peace movement could be started uh, for Mexico. Uh, just because Juarez, the murder rate's gone down, the rest of the country is suffering. I asked him if the violence could be reduced without corruption. The government all forces of the police, uh, state, municipal, uh, federal, uh, politicians perhaps, uh, your neighbor, we don't know who's who in Mexico, it's one of the saddest stories in the world today. One of the saddest stories, and one of the reasons Charlie Min traveled back to Mexico for a second film. His first film set in Mexico, Eight Murders a Day, was released in 2011. I'm trying to give the victims a voice, I'm trying to give them help. Uh, they've been brutally cheated, and uh, they need a voice. The new movie premieres October 5th. Sloan Patton, KRWG News.